now hearing the 911 calls after a repo driver shot and killed a man in Lauderdale. It happened while that driver was towing that victim's car. And we now are getting some new information about what let, might have led up to that deadly confrontation. Local 10's Christina Vasquez reporting. Police releasing the 911 calls on this ongoing shooting investigation. Yo, 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 yo. A frantic call into 911. 911, 911, please. I need, I need, I need, I need police right now. Related to yesterday's deadly shooting in the 100 block of Carolina Avenue in Fort Lauderdale, police say a tow truck driver fired shots. The sound captured on a nearby surveillance camera. <laughs> After getting into an altercation with the owner of the car, he was in this neighborhood to repossess. Tow truck driver killed this man. It ends, police say, with 38 year old Clarence King dead. The tow truck driver shooter detained who is cooperating, they say, with the investigation and this chilling observation from a resident. When I came out, the guy was already on the ground and the tow truck driver was just standing over his body on the cell phone. I need police right now. I need police right now. Which takes us back to that agitated 911 caller <laughs> who is short on details, dropping expletives and a request for an ambulance without providing an address. Already answered the call in. What's the address? I need, I need, I need ambulance right now. Saying his phone was freezing. I do not have the exact address. My husband keeps on trying to call you guys, but for whatever reason, his phone keeps on freezing. A female caller telling the operator. He's working. He works in a tow truck. Please say if you witnessed the shooting incident to give them a call. Police tell us that their detectives are working with the Broward County State Attorney's Office to determine whether charges will be filed. In Fort Lauderdale, I'm Christina Vasquez, Local 10 News. Christina, thank you.